When the James Webb telescope was launched, NASA had really high hopes for it. However, they were expecting the telescope to find evidence of extraterrestrial life so soon. In fact, the recent developments by the telescope have even left the scientists quite shocked. The telescope was launched so it could look into distant planets and the atmosphere of outer space, but it's already making waves and producing conspiracy theories about alien life in outer space. So did the James Webb telescope actually discover city lights? Keep watching to find out. Since the first images of this telescope were released, we've understood its true potential and how the world was pretty much underestimating James Webb before. Now we can't wait to explore the world using the infrared light technology of this telescope. Scientists were clueless that the first few images from James Webb will completely change the course of space science and would even raise questions on the legitimacy of the Big Bang Theory. And the telescope hasn't even been in space for a year, so we can only imagine what it's going to discover in the upcoming few years. Some astronomers are pretty certain that they're going to find traces of life in outer space with the help of James Webb. It's the very reason why they're directing the telescope towards planets where there's water and carbon. These elements are basically the first thing that prove whether a planet is habitable or not. Then James Webb also analyzes the temperature and overall weather of the planet. With this, it becomes able to find out pretty much everything about the planet from its composition to nature. So it wouldn't be wrong to assume that we're closer than ever to finding our true origins in alien life with the help of James Webb. The James Webb Telescope is making such promising discoveries that even the President of America has called it a new chapter in the history of the universe. We're surely going to see our planet and outer space from a completely different lens and find out how exactly our universe formed. That's because the James Webb Telescope could look billions of years back in time. So if it could trace back the origin of the universe, there's a possibility that it could also trace back the origins of humans and life. But the thing that intrigues most scientists is that does life actually exist outside of our Earth? Most of them are the view that there are aliens and we aren't just advanced enough to reach them yet. However, we're surely getting there. It almost feels impossible that in such a huge universe with billions of planets, only one planet manages to host life while all the others are empty. It completely opposes logic and maths. So far, all the images we've received by NASA look like pieces of art because they're so colorful and vibrant. People assume that the universe is actually that colorful and, as a matter of fact, it actually could be. But these images are edited and developed by scientists, so humans could see them because James Webb only sends back data that has to be decoded. The most exciting data we've yet received is only from 1,150 light years away from WASP-96b. The planet isn't inside our solar system, and James Webb observed it by using its near-infrared camera and spectrograph. Then, the telescope measured the wavelengths coming from the planet and kept observing the planet for more than six hours. When the data got back to Earth, it certainly was worth it, and the scientists got everything they were hoping for. WASP was considered a lot like Earth, and it was even said that there's a possibility that this exoplanet hosts life. So, these observations of James Webb could actually help us better understand if life could exist on this planet at all. The data received from James Webb clearly shows that there's water on the planet, and there are also a lot of gases that are similar to that of Earth. The planet has very short days, and there's lots of water in the form of vapors in the atmosphere too. Even though according to scientists the planet is way too hot to cater any kind of life, it is still being said that the other half of it is always dark, and it could actually be home to some organisms we don't know about yet. And it makes sense that we weren't able to find aliens because maybe they're really good at hiding, and they live on a darker side of a planet where we can't really see anything. Though some people are of the opinion that life can never exist on this planet because of its overwhelming temperatures, the possible theory put forward by scientists is that half of this wasp planet is facing its star, which is why it always remains really warm but the other half is completely dark at all times. So when the temperature is distributed among the whole surface of the planet, it pretty much becomes moderate and perfect for catering life. Some scientists are still not sure if this theory is reliable enough to think that aliens might be existing among us, but it surely is credible enough to think that there could be microbes and single-celled organisms in outer space. And that's exactly how life on Earth started. So it's also a possibility that we're a couple of years ahead of them. However, the news about this planet recently blew up when the conspiracy theorists claimed that James Webb had detected city light and WASP while observing it. People were all over this news, and it even became a trend. 
But the only problem was that there was no evidence to support these claims, and NASA never really released an official statement saying that they detected any kinds of city lights. So it pretty much is a sham by conspiracy theorists. In fact, we're still in the beginning stages of finding life in outer space because we've hardly discovered compounds like water and carbon monoxide that could support life. We've not even moved to finding single-celled organisms or any kind of technology in outer space. Scientists at NASA know that they need to observe everything and progress gradually because anything sudden could pose a certain threat. A lot of scientists even believe that aliens are a lot more advanced than us and that's why they've managed to hide themselves for so long. And if we take the example of sci-fi movies, it pretty much makes sense. Although with the progress of James Webb, the day when we discover alien life in outer space doesn't seem very far away. Most astronomers even think that it's only a matter of a couple of years and we'll be able to even communicate with the aliens if we find them in outer space. So that sounds really scary because if movies are any indication, we should just let them be. On another note, the city lights incident is a total sham, but we still don't know the truth behind it because there have been a whole lot of UFO sightings and even people have seen lights in outer space while live broadcasts. But NASA always manages to push it under the rug. So can this city light thing also be another secret of NASA that it doesn't want the world to know? Well, tell us in the comments. Also, make sure to land your Curiosity satellite on our subscribe button and also hit the bell icon. We'll see you in the next video. Till then, take care and thanks for staying with us till the very end.